Hi there guys, Tim here at KML. Just a quick update for you at our project here at uh, Adam Park Road. So we've had the scaffolding go up there. I don't know how well you can see that. Uh, we've had a few leaks uh, in the roof, so we've just got our contractors going up there to uh, re-bed some ridge tiles uh, and replace some lead flashings. So we've stopped internal work because um, obviously if you have any sort of leaks, uh, you know, the last thing you want to do is plastering and then have, you know, the, the roof leaking on there. So, just taking out the back here. So, we've dug some footings for the rear extension here. Uh, see if I can give you a bit more perspective. So, as you can sort of see there, we're going to have a small rear extension there. So, there'll be another, another room going on there. So, what we'll do is, obviously, uh, get uh, a dam course put in there, we'll uh, get some insulation, brickwork will start going up, uh, and then we'll get some sand and cement to bring the, the, the ground up to, up to level. Uh, so we've also had an internal wall that's been taken down. So if you can sort of see there. So the kitchen's going to run all along this wall and we'll have a, a dining room table. Uh, and that will, out the back there, that will lead to that uh, that third bedroom. So I'll just take you for a walk up here. So, small extensions like that can be a really good way to add value. Uh, on other projects, we've done it under permitted development, but this is uh, in an Article 4 area. So, uh, basically, permitted development rights don't apply. So you need to... Uh, apply for planning, it can be a little bit more stringent, but um, yeah, adding rear extensions like that, loft conversions, it's a great way to add value, uh, get some more rental income out of a property, possibly a higher rental income if you, if you do a light refurb as well. So uh, just here as well, as I've already shown you in the past, we've got uh, a lot of uh, internal stud work going up for our own suites and lots of door frames. So things are coming along really well here, uh, and particularly at our other project, Jiggins Lane, which uh, Daniel's done an update on. So we'll, uh, we'll keep you updated here. Uh, as always, if you have any questions um, about any of the projects um, or property in general, feel free to let us know. Take care, bye.